Two families are now bonded together after losing their children to gun violence nearly a week ago. Yeah, a nine year old girl and a television journalist shot and killed after a suspect in an earlier shooting returned to the scene and killed them both in a neighborhood near Orlando. But the big reveal amid all that pain today at that press conference, that journalist's fiance says his sperm was harvested and she hopes to carry his baby. Julie Salomon has more. The father of Dylan Lyons spoke publicly Thursday, saying in a press conference, I wish I could have taken the bullet. His son, a 24-year-old TV journalist in Orlando, was shot and killed when a suspect in an earlier shooting returned to the scene, opening fire on a TV crew. The 24-year-old's photographer was also injured but has been released from the hospital. Dylan went to UCF for journalism and he loved being a reporter, just loved it. He always told me he wanted to tell the story for the people. Dylan's father says his son wanted to look and be a professional. Dylan grew up in Philadelphia and attended UCF. He started his journalism career in Gainesville before getting a job at News 13 in Orlando. Dylan often talked about wanting to be the next David Muir and asked when he was going to retire so he could move in. Dylan's father sharing a hug with the father of Tiana Major. The nine-year-old loved gymnastics and was described as loving and compassionate. Orange County deputies say after the suspect fired shots at the TV crew, he entered a home through a sliding glass door, shooting and killing the child. And she wanted to give to all the little children that needed stuff. Like she was just my heart, my angel. <laughs> Like, and I'm gonna miss it so much. Two families bonded together by a similar grief, gun violence changing their lives forever. Parents living with the heartache of losing a child. Julie Salmon, ABC Action News. We want to go to some breaking news right now.